Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, my God. I mean, the Lord has unloaded. I had to be at least three quarters of heaven. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! I'm, I am I am lit up in the Lord like I have not been in a long time. I used to get like this all the time. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> I'm about to the place where I can't function. <laughs> uh, I'm. <laughs> He said, what's funny? I have no idea. <laughs> oh, my God. Where am I? I'm sitting in front of somebody's house. Please take a watch the ammo. I'm a, I am, God has gotten me drunk. I mean drunk. I mean, I am stone drunk in the Holy Ghost, man. <laughs> oh. I saw that post. I just post while it go. Oh my God. Oh, the Lord. Boy, he knocked me up today. <laughs> I'm telling you. I posted on Facebook because, man, this year has been one tough year. And, you know, my mom just going on to be with the Lord and all that. And I was asking the Lord today at lunch. I said, Lord, I want to partake of your glorification. And, Without getting all into the scripture about all that, just I was asking God for a big blessing today of his presence, of the anointing of the Holy Ghost. <laughs> I said, Jesus, I give you the praise. That's about all I could get out of my mouth. It was just like, <laughs> I mean, Jesus, I'm low. <laughs> and I'm trying to do my job and... I'm right here. I'm in somebody. I'm in a neighborhood. I take water samples <laughs> for a mud district. <laughs> oh my God! I'm in front of somebody's house. <laughs> and I'm like, I don't even know if I can get out, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh Lord God, help me! Help! Me. <laughs> like I don't know if I need to ask any more help from the Lord. My God. <laughs> I am drunk. I am I, I, in the spirit. I mean, really, in the Holy Ghost. I ain't. Uh, I, I have. I've been sober for thirty years, <laughs> uh, but not with God. I've been. <laughs> I just haven't been like this in a while. <laughs> Golly. Oh dear Jesus! I gotta get out and try to go back to work. I gotta try to go back to work. Hi. <laughs> I was, I was, I was, well, the, the Lord, I asked the Lord today, and I said, Lord, I need a blessing. I mean, I need a big blessing. And I went to go, Lord, thank you or something. And before I could even get finished with it, it was just like, Phew. I mean, it's just like God just unleashed. I mean, God, please. <laughs> oh my God, I'm, I, I'm, I am three whatever shades of blue in the wind or whatever that phrase is. Oh, my God. I'm like, Lord, I got to try to go back to work. <laughs> Get out. <laughs> I mean, I don't really mind it. It's just, you know, people call my job and say, hey, your dude's out here drunk and he can't. <laughs> seen this like this before but oh, oh my god oh the Lord. <laughs> excuse me I was, I was about to say lord help me i was like well, wait a second i don't know if i need to ask again <laughs> and that might be it he might may be gone oh like my god i needed this too it's been a rough year Oh my God! But my, I wasn't ready. I always ask God for the big one, and uh, He gave me the big one, and I, I wasn't ready for the big one. Oh my God! <laughs> oh, oh! <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> oh, he fixed me. <laughs> Oh my God! Ah, I didn't feel 
feel like working because everything I've been through the last few days. Now I don't even feel like working because I don't think I can. <laughs> I'm calling my boss. Bob, Jesus got me drunk in the spirit. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, Jesus, dear Lord. Sorry, I mean, I am a, I'm a good mess, I, but right now I'm like, good grief. And I mean, in a good way. Uh, <laughs> Y'all have a good day. I got to try to get out. Oh, my God. I don't know how I'm going to do <laughs> Oh, Jesus. <laughs> he said he makes you laugh. Well, he doesn't make me laugh as a release of his presence and I yield to it and the more I yield to his presence it intensifies God's not really doing anything he just gave the blessing and I'm cooperating with him by yielding to that blessing and as I keep yielding and as I keep focusing on the Lord it intensifies and I'm like you know it's like you kind of it's like a river you get you get too close to the river, you might just slip in, and next thing you know, you're way down there. <laughs> oh my God! You can't make this up. I'm telling you, <laughs> I can't. I mean, I'm I'm high, I'm high, strong, eccentric, and everything else, but man, I couldn't do this. Oh my God! I kind of want to come out a little bit. It feels good. It feels really good. I mean, really. Oh, my God. But I need to go back to work. <laughs> I better try. If I keep talking, it would be over with. I may not have a job. <laughs> oh, okay, I can do this. I can do it. I can. <laughs> and the harder you try, it gets worse. <laughs> I'm out of it. I'm like, Lord, I got to go back to work. I do, it. Lord, please. <laughs> you, you, the Bible says we need to work. You even said, Lord, let me. I need to kind of come out of this, so I can go back to work and obey you to work. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> ah, the Lord's good. He is. He really. My God, I needed this. Oh my God. It's just like all stress and just issues and life just out of you. It's like the presence of Jesus just pushes. You know, heartache, pain, stuff, you know, things, you know, that we go through. I mean, that doesn't make us exempt from life. I ain't going to say that. It, it's, I was posted scriptures out of Second Corinthians chapter 1. And Paul was saying, you know, hey, we were suffering, you know, we're serving the Lord and all this, blah, blah. I mean, I'm paraphrasing. Sorry, I don't mean to make it sound so nonchalant, but... Uh, whatever, uh, but uh, he was saying, you know, hey, man, we face some resistance, and man, we were getting persecuted, but Jesus poured himself his blessing like this out on us, and it's called the consolation, that's what King James uses, The not really how we use that word consolation, but it's, it's, it's the comfort of the Holy Spirit, the Holy Spirit comforts us in this life by releasing that very presence of Jesus, uh, uh, that that he through the suffering that Jesus went through produced this comfort so that we can draw off him and walk in this life even when everything is not just hunkadory and, and have joy in the face of tr trouble why because we know our God the Bible says in Daniel eleven thirty two oh wow, I got the Daniel it says they shall know their God and do mighty exploits hallelujah. Yeah, it gives you boldness and strength, and it causes fortitude and attitude. God attitude. <laughs> yeah, good attitude. It's a good. It's a good tude. It's not like a bad tude, but it gives you attitude. It brings confidence. It brings stability. It lets you know my daddy's up in heaven. I'm talking about my God, my daddy. I ain't just talking about my daddy, daddy. Holly, I'm talking about God. My daddy is saying, boy, here's some help for you today. And I pray I release that to you. I release that blessing to you. Just open your heart and say, Lord, I'll take it. In Jesus' name, Father, let it go to everybody else, anybody else, or whoever wants it. Lord God, because it doesn't, it's you and it's your blessing. 
And you said, freely you receive, freely give. I also ate a sandwich, so I'm, oh, excuse me. <sighs> it just, sometimes you just gotta let the tater chip rip, <laughs> however it flows. They uh, try to be a little more professional, but whatever, I don't know. Father God, let your blessing, your peace, your joy, <laughs> your kingdom, and the blessing of it, Jesus, be upon and in your people with me. I'm one of your people. Thank you, Lord, for being so good to us. Lord, you are so good. Even with everything going on in this world, thank you that you have us on your mind. <sighs> thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Thank you, Father. I love you. See you next time. Hopefully. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I gotta come out of this somewhat. I gotta, I gotta kind of ease out, Lord. Hopefully, the, uh, I don't want to fall down when I get out. <laughs> Love you. Bye bye. <laughs>